an inside look on the Mimic Cody skin developed by Brian Brazil. And make sure you visit Cody.tv and register on their forum for to visit his thread. What's up guys, it's XBM Connect here and in this video I'm going to show you a skin for your Cody setup which is Cody 14.0 or Cody 14.1. Now you could install the skin that uh, you're seeing right now which is called Mimic and the version right now is 1.0.4 and the developer of it is Brian Brazil. So big ups to him for creating um, this skin. And it does have a few touches from Refocus skin and Aonox skin that you've seen um, throughout all the XBMCs and Cody uh, skin. So this just makes it, um, to me, a little less complicated and a little more modern and just more simple look. So as you can see right now, it's just um, we have a blue theme color that we're seeing right now and uh, I think a background of a disc uh, which you can change so you can see right here you have the sub menu that you can go to it and then as and then um, files as well so what we're gonna do is go down to system and then obviously you can see that it has its own skin setting so let's go to system so you can see that it has its own skin setting so you can see you go right here and then skin settings and then from there you could uh, do the setup the menu like uh, have you seen um, everywhere else you could have custom menus as well about six of them or you could uh, just change these as well within um, the action and then um, what's cool is you could change the sub menu as well so you could add it or delete it from here or you could um, change the type where you want to do it on so if you have a bunch of add-ons or videos you could do it and change it as well so we're not going to uh, get into that too much. You can show info, show fan art overlay, which is that blue that you see on the um, the background. And you can take off uh, to not show the clock. So I'm going to show you that right now so, just so, uh, so you can see. So it's not that blue, which um, makes it a little better. I mean, you can sh show the fan art on your TV or on your phone or your tablet or your computer that you can see the background, which is a little... Um, nicer in my thing but it's totally up to you on how to change it and then um, we're gonna just gonna leave it the way it is and you didn't see a clock as you can see right now and then we'll just add it to that so let's go ahead and go to general obviously you can just change the setup background images from um, you could enable it on fan art or you could disable it and enable and then if you choose um, a movie one and you could just change whichever you want or a random fan art or music or it depends on if you want a single image just one or the multi image that interchangeable backgrounds which I like better um, but then again it's really up to you so let's go down to extras not too many um, things right here and then advanced you could change the way um, the list view of the way it looks so if you go change this to slim it'll be a lot more and then the navigation style fixed or default meaning if let's say I'm gonna show you fixed right now meaning uh, it just keeps on going I see right there and once you get to the end it goes to the other one to the left so that's pretty much fixed um, and then the menus just show up which is um, the slim TV look so let's go ahead and look at um, let's go to videos and I'm gonna go to add-ons so I'm gonna show you the skins of this um, mimic um, skin so as you can see right now this is basically the the list and the overlay of the blue you can change it to big list and the way it looks right here and then info wall showcase so it does touch uh, some bases on other skins that you've used um, that you've seen in the past which is always a good thing I mean there's the poster and then shift which uh, I like better um, and then the banner wall this is only good if there's like a uh, TV shows that you're you've collected or streaming so the metadata could show and then banner info which just takes the fan art and then fan art which is good too but you have to do it one by one so and then icons which is a quick way of just checking out um, varieties of movies to watch and then gallery one by one again and then the panel now this 
and then the wall which is really really good I wish it'd pop out like some of the skins when we we're choosing a movie and then back to the list so that's how it looks uh, let's go ahead and show you um, choose one of these and I'll show you the way it looks when a video is playing so um, that's the way it is the, the, the buttons are at the top and then the scroll is at the bottom so I'm gonna press stop on that real quick out of this oops now let's go ahead and check out the way TV shows look like on this so as you can see this is the list the big list info wall showcase poster which you've seen and then shift and this is the banner wall I was talking about um, a lot of the TV shows uses uh, TV banners so it's a lot neater the way it looks and then banner info uh, it changes to the right which is really cool too so let's go ahead and um, I'm gonna check out one of the uh, let me show you some more <laughs> sorry about that and then fan art is one by one icons gallery panel and then wall so I'm gonna show you um, one of these real quick so let's choose this one as you can see you can change the way it looks as well too and then let's say if you wanted one and then this is the way the episodes look sometimes the episodes has a this one's cool too right there and then the icons a little less now this is what I like about the TV episodes um, show that it has this how it just simplifies it that's only can be done on the TV show. It can't be done on movies. So that's the only uh, views you can use on the the skin. And then on the mimic skin, you could actually change the color of the the, the how it's blue right now. You could actually change that to where. Um, let's go to system, and go to appearance, and go to uh, skin default, which is white like really really bright it turns on your TV like really bright if you like it that way if you want that um, flat look you could as as well and then you can change the fonts as over here let's see if it changes I don't know if you see a difference but uh, <laughs> um, and then there's a few colors that you could have obviously you've seen the white um, let's do the white I'm gonna show you right there real quick so that's the white and then purple which is the everything else mauve gray green I'm gonna show you all of it there's only a few uh, skin I'm gonna change this to the way it looks sorry about that and then that's brown where, where, where were we uh, brown right black and red which is kinda cool too black and purple black and mauve green black and blue so for instance let's leave it that that right there and then go out and it's a little darker from the way uh, the, the way it was defaulted so that's pretty much it on the mimic skin uh, thanks to the developer of um, Brian Brazil and make sure you check out Cody.tv forum and check out the thread on the mimic skin to see if there's updates or you can talk or whatever you want and again thanks again for watching make sure to check out my uh, video on installing a skin on Cody and don't forget to add XBM connect to all your social media